Hey Mercs, today we're diving into the design choices behind the combat of Remnants of the Rift, our upcoming interdimensional roguelike where tactics meet action. In our game, the action takes place in the Bast, an alternate dimension full of danger and secrets. Upon arrival, one of the first things you may notice is the isometric view and the grid-based maps. Morgan, our leading character and East mercenary, gets around quickly enough, one tile at a time. The movement and view complements one of the game's bigger design pillars, pausing the game to plan your next move. In our game, the action runs in real time, but you can pause the combat. Just select a skill and the game will automatically pause so you can swap skills to find ones that fit into your plans. If you want to plant a mine, dash through enemies, set off an AoE attack, maybe you can even stun that big fella before they make a move. Take a moment to get tactical with your next move. Morgan will get stunned momentarily if they get hit by an enemy attack, but they will persevere through the pain. However, your modulator is a bit more fragile, and their destruction signifies the end of your run. And that's all for now, Mercs. We'll have more to share about the game in the new year coming soon. Happy holidays from all of us at Bromeo, no matter which dimension you find yourself in.